Hello everybody and welcome to Nascentius Play Stellaris as the Jedi. We are now controlling pretty much this entire region. Our allies doing something like this over here. So it feels like we're almost halfway there. Looking at a victory condition, uh, we're yeah, not yet. But soon. Alright, so time to organize things a little bit more. Uh, we have fleets and such like that. This is the Liberator fleet. Um, I'm gonna join them up with our 7th fleet. Join them of course over here in, in Spring because it has the awesome place with re reduction to pretty much all the costs. And our Frigate fleet. I really did like them a lot. Um, you're gonna be stationed here in Gre Grekil and Grekil is gonna experience a large increase of his spaceport capacities because he's gonna be our new frontier base uh, because we probably will be expanding this way maybe even through these guys they're dismissive research complete because I kind of hate them <laughs> Gene Warriors and Clone Commandos. So we can build Space Marines now. Genetically en enhanced Super Soldiers. Recruits are typically chosen from the elite of the conventional military forces. These then undergo extensive gene therapy and are made larger, stronger, faster than the former peers. But we're not going to use them anyway, so we might as well get some leader capacity. Because we ran um, out of leader capacity last episode. You actually can heal up. Because you were damaged in the, in the fight. Or maybe we just want to leave these cruisers like by themselves. And... Why can't I move them? That was weird. Yeah, I think I'm gonna leave the cruiser by themselves, make this like the elite strike force still that it is. Massive battleship firepower. And then have some cruiser fleet running around and some uh, frigate fleet as well. Alright, that's the next job. Putting these guys together. Um, we're gonna embark all the other robotic armies as well. This is just simple droids that we are using to destroy all our enemies. Full 8, 12, 16, 20, 23, 27. So let's remove that. So these, 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 these. And these 8, 12, 16, 20, 24. 28 yeah that's nice so these guys should all join together I don't know let's make a one group over there and these three should group over here and these should group over there so we have kind of equal amount of sizes and then next I'm gonna queue up a whole lot of extra ships. Build some cruisers. Six, seven, eight. Let's build eight cruisers. And then build some extra corvettes. Start with three everywhere. And then later on, queue up more. Oh, we can't do three even because we just ran out of minerals. It's because we queued up eight uh, of those frigates. Uh, no, not frigates, uh, cruisers. They're really expensive. We can do that once these guys are all located. Yeah, you might as well embark as well. 
and I will join you over here. I mean, might as well, right? Since they're otherwise doing absolutely nothing. And uh, I can't see them now. Yeah, but they, yeah, they have the attachment of the Psy Warriors, so they're actually not that bad at all. Not them, but the rest of you should group up. You're already not a group. You should group up as well. Oh, except for these guys. Alright, this is one of my stations actually. Alright. You should keep an orbit. This is one of my own planets. This is a really nice big one. Right? Yeah, that's true. Well, look at that. There's so many upgrades to be done over here. My oh my, we have time being slacking over here. I think we're gonna make this a physics lab. Skip that for a bit. Oh, so many upgrades. How could I have forgotten that? All right, that's that. Uh, the energy can come later. Construction complete. Am I forgetting more upgrades on other planets? And some mineral stuff. Yes, there is one over here. A new election. Not that interested, to be honest. So over here. Research complete. That's yeah, only mineral stuff for the rest. All right, more ship hull points. Absolutely nice. Um, I really don't like any of them, so let's go for the swarm of missile. Because it unlocks something, gets it out of the queue, and actually is one of the cheaper ones as well. All right, everybody build three uh, cruisers, uh, no, not cruisers, corvettes already. That's quite fast. Bring all the th three of them to here. Uh, let's see, this transport fleet should be elsewhere, I think. To put you over there. I'm gonna recall my embassy. How is the terraforming going over here actually? We're not terraforming anymore. Oh, it is a continental world. Oh, we need to colonize this as soon as possible. Uh, let's see. You have some nothing to do. Like a colony ship. Space for him. Construction Great. complete. Construction complete. Everybody is uh, gotten here already. Put together. And we just wait a bit. Uh, how long until we are <clears throat> president again? So about nine years, because the presidency changes every uh, eight years, uh, five years. So yeah, about nine years before we're president again. Maybe we can get these guys to actually declare war on us first. I did recall the embassy, and the reason why is like. I feel we can take him on. I really do feel we can take him on. I kind of want to show that. Crew quarters and engineering bay. Yeah, that's all you need. Then the big fleet. You can be stationed over here as well. I 
Yeah, and then uh, especially with all our allies and all our fleets combined, uh, it shouldn't be much of a problem. Let's make this a good base as well. Can we? Of course we can. The planet's surface is full. You have enough food so we can turn this into crew quarters and this into an engineering bay. Research complete. And you, 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 the, this fleet can actually be there. More leader capacity. Um, since we are using armies, we might as well do this as well. We have quite a large number of them right now, so why not? Uh, let's go with army health. Albion is almost done with his colonist ship. Construction yeah, complete. Uh, we go here. Click colonize uh, this guy. This looks like a really nice spot to start on. Yeah, let's start over there. I'm not sure if I clicked the right place though, so let's do it again there. Quite a lot of food inside. We're losing a little bit of credits. Not much. How are our planets doing? Perfect. I mean, they are more than double over their energy credit stockpile limit, so I would say they're good. They're good. They are not losing anything. Yeah, we're good. We're really good. I believe we have some technology to limit the time that it actually takes to finish the colony, so it shouldn't take much time at all. And how about you? Did you finish your modules? Almost. And there it is. Yeah, we only have one actually, so it Incoming still takes nine months. Uh, we can go for... Let's go face disruptors. Even better anti shield stuff. Let's do a research agreement. We still want to help our allies at least. While we are building up this massive fleet. So, as far as I know, there is a large chance that they declare war on you when your relationships are minus 75 or lower. Um, we're not gonna get there with just the embassy ticking away. But maybe if we declare them a rival and insult them complete. a bunch of times. Alright, they've finished their engineering bay and the crew quarters. Anything else we want here? Construction completely. You do the same. All right. I think it's time to queue up uh, a couple of extra frigates. Corvettes, of course. I mean, Corvettes. I wish I could like mass build Corvettes or something like that. That's going to be really difficult to implement, I think, as well, because Oh, well, you want to have the best of them. Oh, we have a lot of minerals left over. Let's queue up another four everywhere. Uh, seven. Because, you know, we, we have like Corvette assembly art, uh, which is making build things faster. Oh, actually, Spring, you don't have a. Fleet Academy, you should finish that as well. And that as well, the Fleet Academy is also important. And uh, especially in, like, Durable is by far the best place to build our ships. Because it has the most upgrades to, like, uh, 
hull points, and kinetic weapon damage, and the fleet academy, the navigators guild, all those things. And like not the liturgy cast because we apparently can't find it anywhere in the galaxy anymore. It's really rare. Maybe we should do a run through our allies to see if somebody has it. It's a different kind of gas, some team gas, whatever that might be. A lot of crystals are everywhere to be found, but the one thing that we need is nowhere to be found. Zero. All right, that was the warp uh, cool stuff. Nope. Did we check these guys? Angus Vapor. Sounds uh, really crazy. Something we don't have. Research complete. Well, I don't think we need it either. Swarm of missiles are done. Sure, let's go for level 2 of that. Or do we want to unlock synthetics? Get some artificial intelligence going. Maybe we can get that crisis to see. Because I, I haven't seen any of the endgame crises yet in this game. And... Uh, I kind of want to. Wait a minute, are we at war with anybody? Rebels of Jedi? Hang on a bit. Are we being like... Do we really have rebels? I'm gonna send my frigates after them. Why is that showing up nowhere? There's a whole rebel system over here. Maybe I missed a pop-up or something like that, but I didn't see anything like that. Where are you now? Colony established. Uh, let's build a spaceport here with some kinetic defense modules and on the surface. Well, it's a really high habitability, so might as well build a frontier clinic here. No, hurry up before they start destroying stuff. Uh, they're gone. But they don't use the same tech as me either. Yeah, okay, we jump right on top of them. That's really weird. Updated. How can we have rebels and not know about it? How can we can we declare peace with them? I don't think so. Because we're technically not at war with them. Hmm. Well, let's bring the fleet over there. Let's we'll transport fleets as well. Let them be close. Let's enter orbit. At least we can, like, make them absolutely useless by taking away all their planets. Situation 96% uh, evasion. Really nice. 
Promising officer. Let's bombard the way at this planet. It does have a really big defense. We have a really big army, so. A really nice general. Research complete. And we have got some extra health on our army now. Let's go for extra lifespan. Construction complete. Lots of the frigates have been built now. So our next frigate army is gonna be larger again. And we're just gonna wait till this whole planet is wiggled down. Stupid rebellions. A planet here and a planet there. It's gonna be really easy to take down. Right, time to land. Uh, why? There are no armies in orbit that can land. We're not at war, exactly! Uh, that's really annoying. We are at war with them, but not really at war with them. Alright, let's go back. Frigates can go there. So we kind of have to keep like a small army on top of their planets all the time so that they're not building any more ships. So that they can't build any more uh, spaceports. That's a good way to keep them at least knocked down That's forever. Destroy all their That's mining stations. Complete. Just make them literally powerless. Hmm. Not happy with it, but fine. We can work there. Hostile fleet engaged. Hostile fleet engaged. They do be. They are really happy still. It's like pretty much on every planet. Yeah. The happiness cap is usually Hostile the problem. Hostile fleet engaged. More upgrades. More upgrades. Come on, just finish them off. So yeah, I probably will like put a ship in orbit here. Might as well put some ships in orbit right now. Yeah, because he is rebuilding. Put some ships in orbit here as well. Situation log updated. So they will never be able to rebuild spaceports and stuff like that. Go around, destroy all the mining systems. Sooner or later, they will collapse. Uh, I hope. So we can't declare war on them because they are a subject. But they're also rebels. Rebel scum. Hostile fleet engaged. Situation. Hostile fleet engaged. engaged. Oh, over here. We're gonna put the big frigate fleet over here to deal with this station again. Yeah, we have a frigate fleet over here bombarding this planet forever. Hostile fleet engaged. Hostile fleet engaged. Kill the construction ship, please. It's the most important part. And after that, they will be in perpetual bombardment. Alright, you're gonna be perpetual bombarding that place. Or you're gonna mop around and take all their mining systems. 
Hostile fleet in gonna make it construction a complete. light bombardment so that they really have nothing to do. They all become Situation updated. unemployed. Hostile fleet engaged. No, it's really weird. I don't think I have the skills to cheat my way into fixing this either. So I'm not sure how to do that. Maybe some console commands would work. Because I'm not playing Iron Man, so I can actually do console command cheating. Um, not really sure what I would cheat in this case though to make things better. That's a bit of a problem. Hostile fleet engaged. Oh well, I think this would work as well. Just keep seven or uh, fourteen of our Corvettes Situation busy at all time. Updated. And a perpetual war. I think it's one of the last systems that they might have. Oh, there's some stuff over here. All right, we have some mop-up duty to do. But this is more important that we destroy this. So that we actually can give our working vassal some stuff back. Relative power of complete. subjects. Hostile fleet engaged. Yeah. So they're, my subjects feel like they're quite powerful. Situation ah update. crap. No, 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 no. You shouldn't be following me. No, 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 no. That's absolutely something you shouldn't do. You need to be perpetual bombing that place. Are my people unhappy with terror bombing? Yeah, they are. I think that has to do with the fact that we are bombarding their planets and stuff like that. But I'm not completely sure. Research complete. Ah, we have the artificial intelligence. Excellent. Ooh, let's get some better armor. That's something we are using some in some places. And uh, which fleet is this? Second fleet. Anti rebels one. And you guessed it, anti rebels two. This way, I will always know which fleet are busy doing that stupid stuff so I don't by accident go around and uh, bring them somewhere else and the rest of you should all come over here you need to build Hostile one more fleet engaged. What, what's this happiness minus five why why is there like an international minus five happiness going on? Hostile fleet engaged. Should upgrade you to planetary administration. Got a bonus farm. Situation log updated. That. Kill, kill, kill. Well, that's gonna be it for this episode. Next episode, we hopefully will wipe out all the mining systems. And we will have pacified them forever. And I think I will send the fleet to learn who these guys are. Because I am kind of curious actually. But that's all going to be in the next episode. Until then, thank you guys for watching. And I hope to see you next time. Bye bye.